this music. This played, um... I think it was with the Orcus Tower Invasion it played. This is like the second time we hear this track. Is that Yona? Are you okay? What's going on at the building? We're fine. These guys with guns came out of nowhere and told us to get out. They destroyed the special alloy gate in front, in the front like it was nothing. We were told the Red Constellation was a top level security threat, but this I wasn't prepared for. Guys, you're here! Yona, Chief Roberts, you're alright. Just barely. Those men had us at gunpoint before we even knew what they were. They were there, words. What the hell? Intel said they were dangerous, not completely freaking cuckoo. And that scary old dude with the red hair? Was that their boss or something? Red hair? Scarlet Ogre. I don't care what he's called. The guy's a freak of nature. What about Belle? Is she still in the building? Mrs. Koi is currently away at Michelin, as luck would have it. She should still be able to keep herself out of harm's way. Oh, thank goodness. Thank the goddess. It seems they had the decency to spare the civilians, at least. That doesn't make any of this okay. What are they trying to achieve? I'm not sure, but it can't be good. We need to get up there now. Right. The way to East Street is clear. Take shelter at the guild. They'll be able to help you. Right. Everyone follow us. We'll take you to safety. Here we go. Hey, Sigmund. What's poppin'? <laughs> I knew we were gonna have a fight with Sigmund after Shirley. I just thought it was gonna be like Shirley and then Sigmund, but this is gonna be our fight with Sigmund here. You made it, and not a moment too soon. <laughs> Uncle, you bastard. Sigmund Orlando, what is it you're trying to accomplish? Destroying Crossbow City, involving innocent civilians? Where does all of this end? Was this on the orders of the Imperial government too? Sorry little lady, didn't I tell you before? It's Korn's policy not to comment about our clients. But enough of that, I heard you dug Berserker up, Randolph. How's the old blade rifle treating ya? I finally had the damn thing fixed up before you lunatic of a daughter went and broke it again. Not that it matters, Berserker or not, I'm stopping you right here, right now. And I ain't saying that as a Red Reaper or the son of the War God. Your ass is going down at the hands of the special support sections, Randy Orlando. Welcome back, Randy. So you've chosen to stand and fight. Fine then, show me that you have what it takes to back those words up. I am the Scarlet Ogre. Think you can drive off Sigmund Orlando? Come and try it. practically pulsing with power. He truly is more ogre than human. <laughs> See what you can do. Hold the candle to me and I'll consider pulling back. But business is business. I still got a job to do. So it's only fair that we put a time limit on this one. Oh what? Okay, this is probably going to be like a scripted battle. Let him talk. If we want to survive this, we're going to have to give it all we got. <laughs> Tempest Rage. Oh, hey, time limit. We gotta beat him in five minutes. How much HP do you have? 33k. It's not a crazy amount. Could be a lot worse. We do have, like, max S crafts, so we should be fine. Ikuyo. I guess that's why I'm making that 33k. Yeah, it did a lot. Good 3200. Randy, get in there. Oh no, overcry. Strength up. Oh, he's using his um, S craft right now. It has the scorpion thing. Constellation. Oh, 
Ellie didn't get hit from this. Okay, that's cool. And by cool, I mean not so cool. Do that. Also, rip my team rush. Stop? Okay. There's no way I have to win this. He's like killing everyone. There's no way. Continue. Oh, you have a choice to. I'm gonna try this one more time. <laughs> it's good to know if I can't win, though, I'm moving on. <laughs> if I can't win this time, I'm just gonna move past it. Mini tiers, TO zero field, do we even have a chance of winning? And that sucks because I can't switch TO in, so I'm gonna have to reload the save, which I don't know when the last time I saved was. Okay. But at the attack buff, he does like. He already does a lot without the attack buff, but the attack buff just makes him ridiculous. Like, Sigmund without attack buff is how he should be, period. I mean, if I don't have to win this fight, technically, then I guess it makes a little sense. I want to see your uh, combination move. We haven't seen this yet. Do you get extra DP depending on how low you get them? Okay, good. I don't have to win. I mean, I already knew that when I saw continue, but that's good to know. I don't mind giving up. Alright, that's pretty cool. I don't mind giving up some DP because we're already not getting all the DP in the playthrough. So. Alright, Ellie. gonna do it it's just insta kills i think yeah screw off i'm not doing this it's, it looks stupid goodbye if i had teo i would have a chance but i don't and i'm not loading a save pretty damn disappointing i thought you were gonna put up more of a fight after what i heard from shirley damn it this is bad we're nowhere near his level of strength and with that, your time's up. Hey, uh, FMD. What have you done? Uncle!
Oswald. It's that girl, too. Damn it. How'd they get their hands on an airship? How did they indeed? What a beautiful sight. Even the stronghold of Crosswell's financial clout has gone up in flames. These red constellation fellows. I'll give them some credit. They're more impressive than our enhanced Jaegers. <laughs> I take it by the surplus, surplus look on your face that you object to this kind of stunt. That's correct. Nevertheless, war by nature. War by nature reserves no room for sentiment. It's not in my place to judge the manner in which they choose to navigate the fields of battle. Fair enough. Ah, Professor, what do you need? Ah, the first unit is nearly complete. Yes, yes, say no more. I'll come back and assist you. And so I must make my exit from the stage, for now. Can I leave operations in your hands until the promised day? Yes, that will be fine. I will observe what fate holds in store for this land with my own two eyes. What the heck is going on out there? I wonder if my husband's okay. Hello down, everyone. I just received word that the armed group has started the withdrawal. We can all return home once we've confirmed the area is secure. We can, really? Oh, Adios, thank you for your protection. Uh, Chief, is everything okay now? Yeah, for the time being, at least. I just hope the gang's alright. I'm sure they are. If anyone will make it through, it's them. Through this, it's them. Yeah, you're right. No matter what anyone says, they've come a long way. Maybe even more than my old squad. This is the special support. That you, Dudley? How's the sitch over there? What'd you say? A Jaeger airship. I was right. There's no other way. This is for the best. Hello? Yes, uh-huh. It's okay. I made up my mind. As evening followed the setting sun, we're here at CNS, heard the alarming sound of gunfire, Jaegers were raiding over Crosswell City, fires rage, our office was held captive. I'm just gonna leave this on the screen. Tragedy strikes Ark and CL. Storm the theater. Rampage of a downtown. Yeah, that's wall. This is like a recap more than anything. I kind of saw it with my own eyes. I'm just leaving this on the screen slowly. Destroying the explosion. Attackers repelled from Orcus Tower. Message to all cross villains, our neighbors. So they're gone, they inflicted the wounds they inflicted remain, they suffered because of a military militia force who performed acts of wanton violence. Take a moment to honor the brave CGF and CPD members. The crossbell has emerged, battered and bruised. We believe we will recover to all crossbellans, our closest neighbors. We beg you, please pray that peace returns to our land. One week after the Red Constellation's raid on Crossbell City. Destruction of the IBC building prompted rising tensions in surrounding nations. In response, Mary Bell and her rule as acting CEO quickly restored all customer data, which had been backed up on terminals on Orcus Tower. Her swift management of the crisis successfully assuaged the concern of foreign leaders. Scars left by the Jaegers still remain in the shaken hearts of Crosswell's people. Yeah, like the children are scarred. News that Ilya Platir had been gravely injured in the attack came as a great shock bolt in an out of state. Moreover, destruction of the CPD headquarters and unknown whereabouts of Red Constellation left the city. Oh, so think about Aerobonia. Independence. Oh, and they got this music playing.
Oh, Hayui's base is done. The police. I see. So you're returning to the CGF. Yes, I voted my transfer here to last a full six months. After mulling it over, I came to the decision that I have to go back. I see. We understand. The CGF sustained the heaviest losses from the incident. You're probably dying to have someone young and skilled like yourself anyway. Well, I don't know if I call myself skilled per se. Sorry about all this. I know things will be busier here now the restoration efforts are winding down. It's okay, you don't need to beat yourself up over it. The CGF has a major role to play here, especially in the light of Crossbow's situation. We will certainly miss you, but we can only respect your decision. Uh, Noel, are you going away? I guess I am. I'm sad I won't be able to see you anymore, Kia. Oh. It's alright, I can still come visit. I'll bring Fran with me too. I heard your sister's gonna be hospitalized for a while longer. Yes, her operation was successful and she regained consciousness. There's nothing to be worried about. But she still has yet to fully recover, as far as her physical condition goes. Sorry to hear that. Come on, Randy. Turn that frown upside down. Don't forget, she's still part of the Force. She was always ready to face danger. If you're blaming yourself, please don't. It's not your fault. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Anyway, I guess this is the last time Noel's gonna be working with us. Right, and I'll give it everything I have, just like any other day. Thanks for letting me be a part of the team for a bit, everyone. The pleasure was ours. That's right, it's been wonderful having you here with us. I'll get all the documentation ready for you in advance. It's been a while since we've all gone out together for dinner like this. It's been a while since we've all gone out together for dinner. Let's fix that. I'll foot, I'll foot the bill, seeing as how it's a special occasion and all. Chief Sergei. That's awfully nice of you. We appreciate the generosity. It's settled then. What say I get us a table at my favorite club? I'll have them call up their finest men on staff and give you a farewell party to remember. What? Now you're speaking my language. I'd rather go somewhere with more babes and less boy toys myself, though. Uh, I don't like either of those ideas. And this is just a restaurant at Michelin Wonderland, the one with the Michi show. I didn't know they had that. Please take up my poor wallet before you get any ideas. Oh, Sergei. That's like one of the funniest lines that Chief Sergei has said. Well, whatever we decide on, we'll need to take care of our work by nightfall. Well said, Zite. Well said. Let's take Zite's advice. We got request. Building. All of these are shorts. It's so surprised that we have so many requests after all that's happened. That being said, none of them appear to be urgent. Not even the a boss sent one. Not even the one a boss sent in is required. No skin off my back. Let's just work through them bit by bit while we do our rounds. Roger. One more thing, everyone. Why don't we take some time in between jobs to stop by Saint Ursula? Oh, to see how Cecile's doing. Also, the music suddenly changed. Ah, that would be nice. We've been so overworked this past week that we haven't been able to visit at all. Through that, we can't just not check in on Fran now that she's regained consciousness. But, I agree, not hearing your, her cheery voice through the terminal is downright depressing. Indeed, even just speaking with her will be comforting. Don't worry, Noel. this isn't going to put us out of our way or anything. Fran's been supporting us all this time, of course we want to see her. Thank you so much, everyone. Of course. Okay, let's go to- oh, Fran's at St. Ursula, of course. We could see Cecile while we're there, though. Three birds, one stone. Don't forget Shizuku. Okay, let's go to St. Ursula later when we have some downtime. Bet. We are gonna stop here. We got through all that fire bit and crossbow. And we'll pick it up next time with chapter four. But yeah, we're, we're in chapter four. We'll pick it up and see what happens. Those of you watching... Can I not move? Those of you watching, hope you all enjoyed. When we come back, we will 
see what we can do and move on the game and see what happens, basically. Uh, I honestly, I, I'm gonna be real with you. I have no idea when the next Azure stream will be. I have no clue. I'll get to it before long, though. But, you know, I, I don't know when it's gonna be, so I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna venture a guess. <laughs> but I'll, I'll get to it at some point, definitely. Because... I'm only playing this, and then Rebirth is one slot. We're definitely not going to start a new playthrough until, like, my spring break, which is, like, two to three weeks away. So, I mean, I'll... I'm going to try to get most of Azure done before I start something new. We'll see. Well, not counting Rebirth, that is. Thanks for watching. See you all next time.